So, hi noobs, today uh, we're gonna have a look in some of the amazing Blender add-on which you might don't know about uh, in the list. We will start from the landscape because uh, this render is mainly focused on this uh, mountain which looks pretty nice, you know. So how to make this? Well, there is an add-on which is pre-installed with Blender. You can just come up to edit references and then come to add-ons and search for land scap here we go this is the add-on in your case it will be like that but you need to hit this checkbox in front of it so it will get turned on and as you can see we have this how let's learn how to use it so and the landscape so hit shift a come to mesh and scroll down just in at the bottom of this you can see landscape so hit this now we have a landscape here it's pretty small for now don't touch anything in the screen because you will lose the settings to be tweak as you can see if i just you know it will be like that just hit this and it will be expand so here is so many settings that we can tweak to get the desired result but uh, i'm just going to show you a quick stuff that you can do with it here is the presets, different presets. You can try all of them, like twins. And as you can see, the patterns change. Cliff. As you can see, we got some cliff. And uh, we have a planet, which makes, you know, a planet like a sphere. So here's some of other settings that you can tweak. For now, just hit mountains, mountains one. I think I love mountains one because it has some great picks, uh, which uh, make it even better. Here is the subdivision level, here is the scale, if you increase the subdivision, it will get detailed and it looks finer. We need to have many subdivisions. There are so many settings, you can tweak around. So, just hit X. Let's move on into the second add-on, which I really love. If I go to material view, or, you know, if I go to, just go to camera view, so you will be able to see through. Just go to render view. And... Uh, so the next add-on is the real slow add snow add-on which makes snow for you uh, i have so so much stuff going around about here in the uh, in this surface in the water surface we have some snow so let me show you how i did it so come up to edit preferences and search for real snow and you will find this 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 option real slow snow and you have to turn it yeah. Does uh, it's gonna work? Uh, okay. So how in order uh, you know how to add this? Well, let, let me just go to solid view and uh, uh, I will you know I will open a new file so you will get a clear understanding of how to do that. So for now, does he accident everything? Shift A. I'm gonna add a cube. So in order to add snow into this object, you can do it with so many ways. Hit N and we have real snow right here in this. Uh, you know bar and we have add snow just hit this and by default it will add snow at the top of it of things so the next add-on is all about trees and other stuff so in order to turn this on just come up to the preferences add-ons and search for uh, you know tree as you can see we have add curve sapling tree generator and just hit shift a we have turned this on just hit a Curve, you, you you will find this in curve and uh, let me okay. add curve and then here you have sapling tree generator. If you just click it, it will add three for you. And here is the option. Here you will have different settings. Also, you will get some amazing presets uh, which I used in my render to make these uh, you know to make in order to make these different stuff you know details in your scene for trees it's not over we can add layers to it as well just hit show leaves for now they are too small you can increase the number that you wish you can just tweak up the settings to make it more realistic but for now just leave it at that it's totally up to you how you want to make it so just hit add it to do everything okay so the next add-on that i'm going to show you is uh ev you know i'm just going to search ev EV generator. It's actually create EV and this uh, shows we 3D sidebar and EV generator. So if we hit uh, N and we got this sidebar, 
come to create we have here ev generator uh, in order to add ev generator we have we should have an object in the scene so as you can see it's get turned on so again select it add new ev you know add new ev and here you, you will have an update option if you make any changes here like for example i'm going to make it uh, 0.1 it's not changing it but if you hit up that ev it's going to change it so that's it for today if you're going if you want to get more stuff like that just hit that uh, red button down below thanks for watching